All right. I want to say that um, ultimately you are respond you are responsible for your own health, not your doctor, not your folks, not your whatever. It's your body. You do whatever you want to it, and you can't really. You could take the advice of the doctor, but with his expertise and way with way usually they're mostly right but for in my case was um like in my case i have this um this uh scar right here this skin psoriasis and you you know you go to the dermatologist and the dermatologist is like oh here's some cream put it on and then but it i have it's chronic illness so I'm like, what is it? And you start looking for answers and going whatever. And uh, I don't know, but uh, doctors here or is it the insurance company, is, there's no, I don't know, primary care doctor or whatever, one person in charge of this and trying to figure it out. It's me who's doing the homework and Googling and everything and trying to like, okay, these are the symptoms. And it's like the curse of the internet, you know, you get like, ooh, but... And then you then you're like okay this included with my panic attacks and all these other symptoms and like my gluten sensitivities and uh, or right now I'm developing gluten sensitivities and so you go to the gluten um, you go to the gastro person and then after that right now at the gastro says I'm like gluten sensitive but the labs results don't come up positive uh, but so I'm thinking it's my teeth, so you just you just gotta keep. Ultimately, you are responsible for your own health, and you just find something that solves solves it. But you know, be careful of the witch doctors and the stuff like that. And uh, yeah. <laughs>